to you today to show you a new style that I did. So I tried this style because Black Coffee uh, tried this style. She did a wash and go. If you guys don't know about her, I'll link her channel right here. Uh, she does weight loss videos, natural hair product reviews, uh, tutorials, all kind of stuff. Her channel is all over the place and I love it. So go check her out if that interests you. Now she did a wash and go and I was so envious because it was so cute. And I can't achieve a wash and go because I don't have like natural kinks and coils. My curls are like coily back here and then wavy and frizzy and all that good stuff. I don't really have like a natural curl pattern. So automatically after I saw her wash and go, I thought about a video that Summer 1988 did where she said, um, I think at the time she called it a wash and go, but she later called it a curl defining video and it's three part series uh tutorial so i didn't do it um on my hair because she already did the video she took a, a strand of hair and then she laced it with laced it that's funny she laced it with uh gel and then like right here that's Derek. she coiled it and it got the little tiny cute coils and she did that like little strands of hair the entire head okay the entire head you put my phone on silent so she said the entire process takes five hours and I'm thinking like Psh, whatever summer you know it'll take me it took me five hours okay she was not playing it took me five hours and I decided to do it at night because I, I think I have insomnia some nights I don't know what's going on with me but it literally took five hours. I started at two and got done around seven o'clock. So, but I like, I love it actually. I love this style. Um, it's so cute. It will probably, she said it lasts about a week. I think it would because when I sleep, I sleep on one side of my, my head. And then like when I sleep, this whole side is like smushed to my hair. And all I do is have to just do this. And it's revived and I like it because it gets bigger as the days go by this is technically my day and a half of doing a style like I said I did it at night so I can't really count that as a whole day but when I first did it like when I woke up it was kind of small and then through the day I just was like playing with it I um the, the the ones in the front I made the coils a little bit bigger than they were supposed to be so I uncoiled some of them give you a close-up shot that and um it got bigger so I just I love this style oh my god I love it so much it's so cute to me and um I love it <laughs> okay so I'm really mad though because I have to wash it out because I'm going to a party tonight color purple and uh, coming to America party, it's going to be at a theater. They're going to be like reciting the lines and oh my god, I'm so excited. You have to dress in costumes. So I'm going to be Patrice, which is Lisa's sister in Coming to America. I'm taking the outfit idea from when she was dancing on the couch. When the uh, rubies were delivered to her sister Lisa, that they were brought by um, Akeem, he was trying to like win her over or whatever because the dude from the barber shop told her to buy the earrings. I'm sorry, I'm a huge Coming to America fan. I know the whole entire movie by heart. I love it. I really honestly want to be Randy Watson who sings um, <laughs> The Greatest Love of All and then he totally switches the, he totally goes to the end of the song. Like he goes, um, you know, I'm not even going to embarrass myself. But if y'all know the movie, y'all know what part I'm talking about when they're on stage. And he's like, Central Chocolate! At the end, yeah, that that part. Or I would like to be Reverend Brown, I think his name is. He's like, he helped Gilligan get off the island. Lord. You know, I think Agent Party, yeah. Love that movie. Oh, my gosh. Anyway, so I have to watch this out because I have to get the look like Patrice. And I don't know, I wash it out. It took forever to do. And I don't want to wash it out because it's really cute. But, you know, whatever. Um, I actually do have to do a product review of a certain gel that I didn't think I needed because I have so many gels. I'm just like, 
my curls don't define, so I don't know what... I, I can't use these gels to review for you guys, like... But uh, now that I have this style that I love, I'm going to start doing it more. Another reason why I like this style is because when I work out, I've been working out. The videos are coming, the fitness videos are coming, I promise you guys. Um, I just got back into it because I was going through some stuff. I don't know, I was like in a funk. I didn't make videos. I don't know if you guys noticed, but videos were just not coming to me unless they were in IBTC episodes. Because I just, I didn't feel like doing nothing. Like, my dad was in the hospital, and some other stuff was going on with me, and Shari J was not Shari J, okay? I don't know. But anyway, what I like about it is when I work out, since I don't do the coils until, like, the end of the strand of hair, you see that? When I sweat, it doesn't interrupt the curl, like the coil. So, excuse me, um, so I can sweat and not have to deal with my hair being messed up. And I like that too because when twist, when I work out with twist, my hair would get like frizzy when I'm like on the ground doing push, I mean, when I'm on the ground doing sit-ups and crunches and stuff. So this don't mess up, mess that up. Like, it doesn't get frizzy. It's gel, first of all, so it's holding in that pattern. Like... I just love the style. Like, I can't even get my hands on my head, which is so bad. But, and I don't get knots, single chair knots or anything. I guess because the coils are locked in place and they're singly, they're done little by little strands. So I don't get the single chair knots. This style is just off the hook. I'm sorry. Okay, so what I use, because I know the title is probably going to mention it. This Curls Goddess Glaze. This is what I used. And to refresh, I used the Quench Curls by Curls. Now, a lot of you guys, if you've been with me for a long time, I, I've made it to a year on YouTube. I'm going to be making my uh, YouTube journey videos soon. Um, if you guys have been with me from early on, you guys know that I won the Nikki May 2003's contest for curls. Uh, it's called best twist out queen or something so technically I'm the twist out queen <laughs> yeah whatever but anyway um so I won four curls products I chose this one the quench curls the whipped cream which is completely gone I used all of this and the uh curl ecstasy hair tea conditioner which is almost gone i use this for my protein deep conditioner once a month i absolutely loved her products i never gave a full review i gave a full, full review at the time but i was transitioning so i told you guys i was going to hold tight and do a full review once i was completely natural and i've been seven months natural now eight months on april 7th i will be eight months natural and i've never did one so sorry <laughs> But this basically, uh, I, I did, with this gel, I did the coils. I heard a lot of reviews that this didn't work on my hair type. But since I don't have natural curls anyway, it wouldn't work. So that's why I tried it with this hairstyle. And I mean, gel is gel. So I don't know if it will work differently with another gel. Summer did hers with Icy Fantasia and it worked fine. So there you have it. Um, but I use, you use a lot of gel when you try this. I just want to let you know. This was like this almost full because I didn't use only but like this much of it. Because I didn't have a reason to when I was transitioning. And you see where it is now. It was up to here. It's up to there when I started. And now it's down to here. So you use a lot. Okay, just let you know. You use a lot of products. Um, I probably won't use this for this again, though, unless I try it with another style and don't like the results. But it didn't flake or anything. I, will, I did it on completely, actually, it wasn't even clean hair. I had just tried a Bantu knot out with this stuff, AG Recoil. Mm. I liked my twist out when I did it before. I did a review on that product and I did a twist out. And it was so cute, but the Bantu knot out was a fail just horrible horrible
but I'm talking way too much. So, uh, yeah, I'm probably not even going to edit this video that much. So I'm going to go because I'm just rambling. But I like this style a lot. If you guys don't have a natural curl pattern like myself and you really want the look of a wash and go, I would definitely recommend trying this out. I will link some of the video in the description box so you can check her video out. It's really detailed. That's why I didn't do a video. But I will do a semi tutorial. So I really don't really know why. But since I have to do a review on this gel, I might as well do a semi tutorial on the hairstyle. And that way you guys can see how I do it, which is basically the same way she does it. But I'm going to do it with a different product. Alright, so that's it. Give you another review. And I also filmed how I refreshed my hair. So stay tuned for that. Bye guys.